So what I'm going to do here is show you the Oogie Boogie Bombs in black light to show you the glowing. See the green layer glows and the dice glow. Let me flip this around. So that's a really bright glow. And then now that I've activated the spiders, they glow in the dark too. Isn't that so cool? All right, on to the video. Hello everyone, it is bath time. Tonight my bath is brought to you by the big meltdown and then we've got a glare of course, but this video is dedicated to Mountain Raven. She did one of these bombs and she said she wished she would have gotten two. And I just happened to end up getting three of them. So I thought in her honor, I would do two of them together. So let's pop them on in and see what happens. Oh, well hers is already better than mine because mine sank. I will do my best to keep them together. My water is nice and hot. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm looking for my towel here. That way, please. This is probably gonna be way too much bomb for my tub, but it's gonna be fun. Did the top fall off this one? Do I have a spider floating around here somewhere? My water's so hot I can barely touch it. <laughs> oh, there it is. There's a spider and it glows in the dark. It's gonna leave you float there. So even though I have the flash and the light on, I am going to attempt to turn on the black light and See if it shows anything, and I forgot it in the bedroom. You focus on that as long as it stays put, and I will be right back. And it didn't stay put, but here I am. Let's see if it does anything with my flash. Well, since everything's covered, you can't really see anything. You can kind of see the spider glow a little. Ooh. Let me see if I can, like, oh. Okay, let's just lift you off. Let me try and wipe this off. Ow, hot. Yeah, this isn't working so well. This one just flipped over and sank. <laughs> okay, <laughs> not the best video I've ever made. But we have a lot of cases of that, don't we? That's okay. So that part didn't work. Let me see. Look, it makes the spider stand out. And it helps me find the other one. Look. You can see it. The dye does glow under black light. It's so cool. I did do a clip of these in black light and if I do it correctly, there will be that at the beginning of this video. So if it worked, you've already seen it. <laughs> and we've got some great bath art that looks really cool. My water is turning purple. We have green shimmer all through the water. It's almost like iridescent. So that's really cool. Back to the bombs. The diamond one. Oh no! I just dropped it in the water. It still works. But I'm gonna set that aside to dry. Because when I bought it, it wasn't labeled as waterproof, so. 
Sorry, I'm busy drying it off. I don't think any water got inside, but I will check it when I'm done recording. But I guess we're done with that. <laughs> this one's just kind of flipping all over the place. Look at how cool that is. This bomb feels so creamy. I'm sure it's because of the coconut oil in it because she uses coconut oil in hers and look at that. It is dying my hands. <laughs> oh well, it'll be gone by the end of the bath. We've got all this awesome bath art. So cool. The bomb smells great, and you know we're gonna get bubbles from this. Look, you can see green sparkles. They are showing up very well. There's a spider. Lost the other one, but it's in here somewhere. That looks really cool. I think that might be it. <laughs> that is it. Just showing off this bath art. Looks so amazing. And there's a bomb. Let's scooch it over. Now they're together again. These are such long fizzing bombs. My water is very nearly pure hot. And it is still a nice long show. So sh these are awesome. Really good quality. still working and what I'm doing is probably dangerous but this thing was like 10 bucks so look the glitter glows this all oh my gosh that's so cool when we are done I am going to turn the lights off and get a shot of this with just the black light and see what happens because look at that. That light green glows. If that fries my black light, I guess I'll have to get another one. It's actually marketed as a urine stain detector. <laughs> Go figure. But it works awesome. So who cares? These are such long fizzing bombs. I'm really sorry I didn't order from this company sooner. And look at that. It's almost, I wonder if that's gonna glow in the dark. Look at this. The art is like standing still. That looks amazing. This is so cool. This is beautiful. I am really liking these bombs. They are excellent for creating bath art. But of course I'm getting impatient because now I'm excited and I want to turn the light off and see what happens. And I'd have to turn my flash off so I will have to stop the video and edit that piece in. But I think I have figured out how to do so, so yay me. See, all I had to do was actually try. I promise I'm not stupid, I'm just lazy. <laughs> I didn't feel like learning, so I didn't. Now that I have stuff I want to edit, I learned it. Well, started learning it.
I'm gonna have about an hour before my roommate gets home to enjoy my bath. And this is going to be a very long video. I hope you all don't mind, but I think it's worth it. Cause these bombs are really cool. And the bath art is really amazing. I mean, just look at that. It looks like a flower. It legit looks like a flower. And the green piece in the middle is the center. I love it. And that looks like a comet now. Mountain Raven, I am glad you brought up the idea of doing two of these in the same tub because this is awesome. So thank you for the idea. And I hope you're enjoying the video. I really don't want to move them around to even see what's left because I don't want to mess up the bath art. So I'm kind of just leaving them be. They're still going. My water's still nice and hot. Plus, I don't want to mess up the foam in case there's any, like, glowing properties sitting on top. Because then that'll just make all that sink. Maybe I can just scooch this one over without messing too much up. There we go. And, of course, they're just going to go away from each other again. It's probably the force of the foam that does that. They don't want to stay together. And, and now we have a cat head. Or a devil head, whichever the way you want to look at it. Because one looks like a horn, one looks like an ear. And they are taking forever to foam. Okay, so so maybe I just pick one up and bring it back here to play with so I can crush a little because I want to crush. Check it. Here's one die. I'm saving these suckers. I will probably actually put these in with a game. It'd be awesome if she recreated these bombs and I could get like six of them and play Yahtzee with them with a black light. Oh, check that. That will totally glow. And look, it's got shimmer all through it. Oh, that's going to look so cool. Okay, now I want to crush the other one. I'm totally dying my hand, but it's worth it. Come here. Let's just pop you out. <laughs> Time to crush more. Ooh, this one's harder. But I'm getting it. You must let me crush. So cool. And real quick, we'll peek in. Um, yeah, the water is black. With, like, buttloads of green shimmer. So that is totally awesome. Alright, guys. I am going to go ahead and stop this one and put the put the lights out and get my black light back and I will edit that onto here so let's wait and see what happens here we are with the black light and check this out this is so freaking cool oh I wish you could see it as good as I did this looks amazing 
Look, I still have a little piece fizzing out here, but you can't see it because it's so bright. This looks so cool. So much fun. There's another piece that's fizzing. It's just really bright. I'm never going to be able to show you that. Oh my God, I love this. And there's the dice under black light. Holy cow. They do not glow in the dark. As soon as the light's gone, you can't see them. Although the spiders will, but I don't think they're getting enough light. Oh, that's the spider. Fun. I'm not even sure where the other one is at the moment. <laughs> but we will not worry about that. But okay. I will be right back to show you what bubbles we can get. Okay, now that I'm all done playing with the black light, I'm going to go ahead and turn my water back on and we're going to see what kind of bubbling this bomb does. This watercolor is so awesome. I love it. And I love the bath art that is now currently moving. We still have little pieces that have not fully fizzed out. I did my best to show those to you. I think I'll take the spiders out now. And we are getting a lot of bubbles. They are totally buildable. The water is totally awesome. And it smells good too. It's it smells better than it did when I just sniffed it through the wrapper. So I am super, super duper excited for this bath. I'm going to run more water in it, but I am going to let you all go first. So I am going to get more bubbles and I am going to hop in and I'm going to enjoy myself. I hope you all have a wonderful evening. And I will see you all next time. Bye.